Good afternoon. Still recovering from my situation I was going through. In in remembering a great athlete, great father, great person, great individual. We have lowered our prices down to $100 for credit sweeps. The lowest we've, we've ever basically had is a $1,500 value. <clears throat> There's millions and millions of sports fans. You know, people that looked up to this man, people that, you know, excite, excited was excited when they seen him play, when they seen him speak, you know. <clears throat> so to lose a sports figure like that, it's devastating. Uh, he represented a better man. Nobody's perfect. But that's what he... That's what he represented. You know, there was people that wanted to be like him. There's people that wanted to be in his image. But there was people that said, okay, I'm going to turn my life around. I can be a better father. Or I can be, be a better star. I can be a better athlete. And because of that, this is why we, our sale is what it is. All this week, Credit sweeps a hundred dollars. We're not trying trying to profit off of his death. We're saying thank you for being a role model to others, to other individuals, and it's it's very important that I get this message out. Because there's, let me tell I'm, I'm gonna be honest with you. There's some fathers out there that don't need the title of being a father. But they changed because of what they seen in Kobe Bryant. They seen a better man, a better father, a better person. People will change because they don't want to change. People will change because they see a figure. The next man. I ran into somebody at the hospital. I was in a. I was on life support. The woman told me. She said my son. Looks up to you. I'm nobody. I'm just. I'm just me. I'm just. To me. I'm just the average guy. But to this kid. She said, he looks up to you. She said, he follows you. He said, when well, you used to play sports, when you were doing this, doing that, all the good things. He said, he has clippings. And this, this blew my mind. Because I'm just the average guy. I'm, I'm here to help people. All my life, that's all I wanted to do is to help people. You know, this kid had clippings when I was playing high school basketball. You know, when, when, I mean, it's crazy. The things, you don't understand that there's people watching you when you're doing good and when you're doing bad. You know, I never forget there was a time in my life where I was going against the court system and they tried to throw me in jail. Yeah. <clears throat> for the dumbest, for the most ridiculous thing I've ever heard of. But they say that it was it's the law. That kid had the clippings to that case. And 
that case, I beat the socks off the prosecutor. And it wasn't because I was good. It wasn't because I was, you know, I was coming up in the ranks. It was because I told the truth. It was because I stood for who I am. I'm not just going to let nobody railroad over me. And that's what Kobe Bryant stood for. You know, he was the he was a man of the people. Never let anybody or anything try to get over on you. And that's what I did. I said, I refuse to go to jail for something that is idiotic. And you know what the funny thing is? The funny thing is, it was all over $9. $9. The law is designed to cripple you. Parts of the law is designed to make you fail. But when you stand up for yourself and you move forward, no matter what happens, you, you come out a better person. Uh, this sale is not just about a sale. This sale is about change. This sale is about victory. This sale is about honor. Don't get the credit suite because whatever. You get the credit suite because you want to do better. You want to see yourself better. You want to see yourself strive. You want to see yourself become something greater. That's why you get the credit suite. You want to see improvement in your life. That better car, that better house, that better loan. Don't get it because I tell you to get it. That's just that's just foolish. Get it because you want to do better. You want to be, see yourself do better. You want to see your family grow along with you and beside you. That's why you change. <clears throat> My prayers go out to his family. Because I look back a week ago. And that could have been me. I was on. I had a tube down my throat. I was in the ICU. I was on life support. They called my ex-wife because they said. They said that I wasn't going to make it. Is that crazy? Now I'm here talking to you. Sometimes things happen for a reason. I have no idea. But when you look back on your life and you ask yourself, have I done everything I could do up to this point? You know, they say that God measures your successes and your failures. And your, all the good things you do, everything, he measures it. And when the time comes, he weighs it to a point where if you should be giving, giving, a second chance. Your wrongs and your rights. That's crazy, ain't it? But it's true.
They say that a person, man or woman, should do many great things. Because when the time comes, you have to answer. I want you to hear that one more time. You have to answer to everything you've done. All the good, all the bad, and all the evil. That's just it. We don't know what people do in their lives. We, we don't know how much good, how much. We only see what's on TV. We only see what, what, what's in front of us. You know, I, I try to do multiple good things every day. I, I, I'm not going to lie to you. I try. That's all you can do is try. You know, I've been this great person. I've always been loyal. I've always been honest. I've always been respectful. Because that's how I was raised. Some people will say, oh man, you're too, you're too, you're, what the guy told me, he told me, you're too honest. There's no such thing as being too honest. You know? And I, I do that because when my time comes, you know, I want God to say, hey, you know what? He tried. He did the best he could do. <clears throat> I almost died several times. I mean, my life is like a roller coaster. It's up and down. And sometimes you got to give you got to give it your all. You got to put extra out there. You know? So. Um, so this is, this is our dedication to the sports world. To fathers that want to better themselves. To mothers that want to better themselves. We are offering credit sweeps a hundred Dollars never done before in history. Uh, this is not going to make everything right. This is not going to make everything right. Is just to show our appreciation for a great man that touched lives in almost every household in the world. If you need this credit sweep, you can call, you no, know, you can text 610-470-8992. Our website is www.kirbyscreditkingdom. Yolasite.com. <clears throat> and I want people to remember that life is too short. Trust me, I know it. I've been through multiple near death experiences. Things that, if I told you, you wouldn't believe. I mean, to this day, I still can't believe it. But every time a situation happens, it's a learning experience. God just doesn't do it because he's, he's bored. He does it because it's a learning experience and it's for you to learn. You know, it's not, it's not what you can do to defeat it the next time. That's not just what it's about. It's about you doing better. It's about the things that you're doing. Keep on doing them. All the good that you're, you're providing, you're doing, you're putting out there. Keep on doing it. You know?
That's just part of life. That's, you know, you got to keep on. You're like a train going 100 miles an hour. And you're doing good things here and there. You're doing all these. And you're being blessed over and over and over. You know. So this is what God wants. The average person, when they go through something, they say, wow, that was close. It wasn't close. It was God. God provided an exit strategy. Because he won't be there in the beginning. He's got to let you go do it. But in the very end, he shows up. Everybody's situation is different. So, it's hard to explain. So, <coughs> my throat's dodgy. Let me tell you something. Having a tube down your throat is not a good feeling. Uh, so, if you're interested in the credit sweep today, $100 the whole week. What's today? I can't, I can't remember what today is. Uh, I think it's... Uh, I think it's Wednesday, I think. Anyway. Uh, if you're ready, today's the day. Don't lose out on this deal. This this is a magnificent sale. But just like I said, don't look, don't view it as a sale. View it as a change in your life. Because my job is to get you where you where, my job is to get you where you need to be. And my my motto is I do not stop until you are where you're supposed to be. If you say, hey Lorenzo, I need to be at 720, we're not listen, we're gonna get you to 720. One way or another. This is what I do. Never give up. No matter what. <clears throat> like I talked about that train. You're that train. And there's houses in the way. And there's debris in the way. And you're going to guess what? You're going to keep on going. You're going to keep on going. Because failure is not an option. And that's, the, that's what you have to live by. Because we are used to giving up. Might as well get off the train. I gotta go because my for some reason my phone keeps on stopping. But 